I do like this park. It's a small park. And this green space area over here is wonderful. Look how close we are to the water. And all of these little toys that are scattered here is included in the price of the RV park. There's no dirt anywhere, but the main areas are all pea gravel or these little pebbly things. And again, the spaces between the rigs are nice and are nicely spaced out. And this is the setup for Wanda. We're space number 12. We got water, sewer, and 30 amps. And it's a fairly large site. It was leveled left and right. And there's ample parking for the truck. So it's a nice park with lots of green space. And they do a good job trimming the grass and keeping it healthy. And again, our view is wonderful. This is our view <laughs> from the back window. It's great. So would I stay in this park again? The answer would be a definite yes. Okay, this is the washrooms. Take a look. Okay, it's a step-up shower and it is clean. And oh, it's queen operated. One loony for five minutes, which is actually not a bad price. Again, it's clean, it's elevated. That's a good thing. This here is only 20 amp. They tried to give us this space here, which is, we did fit, but we would have to disconnect the truck, which didn't really matter too much because we're seeing Uncle Gary and Aunt Loretta here in Vernon, which is the reason for our stop here. However, again, this space is 20 amp and I requested a 30 amp space. And we are right by the lake. Real nice. Okay, where is the laundry room? The grounds are well manicured. I like that. <sighs> okay, two washers, two dryers. Okay, here it is. It's three dollars to do laundry. That includes the price of the dryer. Wow. Right, we're gonna go get laundry and come back. All right, we are at the Vernon Visitor Center. We're gonna see if they're actually open today. Today is Thursday. And hopefully they have postcards. We're looking for postcards of Vernon. Oh look, they have merchandise. Wonderful. Hello, do you have postcards? Yes, on the rack. <gasps> Wonderful. We are at Gray Monk. Not Gary Monk. Gray Monk. Lookout restaurant. We're gonna have lunch here. And isn't this view spectacular? This is the Okanagan Lake. Here's the wineries. 
We're gonna have wine with dinner. So just be careful. Oh, you know I'm gonna touch it now that you said it was <laughs> <Right>? hot. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, it is hot. Yeah. So today. Okay. Before, explain the meats. We have a chicken chorizo sausage here, tri an elk salami there, and a fennel pepperoni over there. For the cheeses, we have a buffalo brie here and here, a herbed gouda on this side, and a smoked Ooh. cheddar on that side. We have a blue grape and ginger compote there, and the crunch mustard there. Wow. wow. Yeah. Enjoy. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Get too close and get in trouble. I keep getting yelled at. <laughs> well, there's a sign over there. The grapes are ripening and perfect for the reds here. Who's driving down the road? They can go around her. I know. I don't want her stepping down. People went around us. And I said something in my mind and it apparently came out. <laughs> so did you get the discount? Did I what? Get it? I got a bottle of wine. Oh. She, she, she calculated the discount, said that it would be $20 on the check, excluding the tip. And it would be easier if you just, are you willing to just take a bottle of wine? And I went back and took yeah. another one of the, she, the said, same ones. I said, okay, if we take Odyssey, because it's $28 or something. Sure, sure, it's okay. <laughs> and I'll just write off the difference. It's okay. Even better. Yeah. <laughs> what a good day is this? This, this is Uncle oh, Gary God. and Aunt Loretta. Hello. Oh. <laughs> Welcome to the Okanagan. Yeah. We just had a wonderful lunch that they paid for. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this, this is all free. Okay, this is Aunt Loretta. Hello. And da Cousin David. Hello. Everyone knows Walter. Yeah. Hi. And Uncle That's Gary. Very, hi. This, this is the most we've ever had in the RV. Isn't this fascinating? Look at this. There's five people in here. All of us. Isn't this amazing? We all fit. And this sleeps six. There's no way I'm sleeping three, four, five, or six in here. It's never going to happen. So we're visiting relatives in Vernon. Yes, the yep. good old Okanagan. Yep. That's not sunny today. Good to be here. Yeah. Gary is aerating the red wine that we got at... Gray Monk. Gray Monk Winery? Oh, Gray Monk. <laughs> I'm going to call it Gary Monk. <laughs> it's taking more than a minute, I think. It's only halfway there. That's okay. She said sometimes a minute and a half. Oh, okay. They do that at the hospitals, too, don't they? Oh. I should have turned the light on. No, actually, it's picking up enough light from. Okay. Yeah, it's like an IV. Yeah. You see, it's a, it's actually a pretty. I don't. La di da di da di da. Interesting. We haven't no, either. I didn't know how this worked until she showed it. Okay. Okay. Now Good you stuff. turn it back up. Now we got to be careful. And I'll turn it back up. I should put the label to your uh, camera, shouldn't I? Mad scientists. Now we have to see if it tastes better. Of course, the real test would have been pouring some of it out to taste it unaerated and aerated. But that's for the next time we do it. Yeah. Okay. It does look. It's but got extra see, bubbles. You can see the extra it's got bubbles. Extra bubbles. She said it's only good for a day. Two at the most. Two at the most. Yeah, it's hard to And then after that, she said only cook with it. Yeah, okay. That's what I usually do when I buy a bottle of wine. It's the last third day it's cooked. It won't all go in. There's too many bubbles. Too many bubbles. Wow. What do you do now? now? What do I do? <laughs> She it's didn't have she didn't have this part of the lesson. Is it not all oh, in? they're all in. It's all yeah, in. Yeah, Is it all in? Don't crack it on that. Oh, you got it. Oh, there! Yeah. Yay! Oh. How about that? Now pour a glass and see if it looks better. Now it's getting very 
read it again. Yeah, there are extra bubbles in it. Yeah. yeah it's very nice wine. <laughs> and it does sort of bubbly, bubble. Bubble. Oh. Yeah. Maybe I do need to get a decanter. Well, there you go. So did you buy that 